yeah what's up youtube back again another video today and this one is just a quick rant about luminate ai the latest software out i've been meaning to do this review for a couple of days but um i've been busy but today anyway is the day i'll be doing the good features of it yeah there's going to be plenty i know that but i just went straight into the body ai module of the software and i'm just going to point out to you some some of the things they've done wrong with it in my opinion and what they should have done to make it a really good piece of AI software for adjusting bodies. Anyway, so I'll jump straight into this picture for instance. Right, so we're using it in the plugin mode in Photoshop. So we will go down to the plugin, open Lumina AI, the software will plug in started, software boots up, and then we can do our adjustments. And then once we saved, it would come back into, into Photoshop. Now, again, just quickly this is like i said this is not me quick with uh, me full review or you know the great features of this software which i'm sure there's going to be lots this is something they have got wrong um now i don't know how i'm not a software engineer so i don't know how hard it would be to fix or add this feature to it but this is what they should have done when it was first released now hopefully they're not one of these companies that are going to keep releasing updates and then make you pay updates and make you pay and add this feature later on this feature should have been part of it straight away in my opinion so we'll go down to the um portrait module and we've got the face skin yeah okay so i've had a quick look at the face that works no problem the body ai the feature that you know that they should have worked on better in my opinion right so we've got the girl here as the main focus of this image and we have a bystander blurred out there and we have a guy walking his dog here okay no big deal you can't really see them now the software being ai should be able to distinguish this is the main subject this is not the main subject by no means okay and just watch what happens so body ai module is on and we're going to just see a shape of the body okay just watch the guy here with the dog it's slimming him down or making him fat <laughs> and this just not doing anything to her now what they should have done with this module would be giving you the ability to add key points around the body yeah key points tick 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 and then give you the ability to adjust certain areas as you need to yeah or even the same as photoshop give you the ability to um use a i'll show you in photoshop you know the how they can you know you can use a liquify tool use a different adjustments just to adjust little points of the body okay that's all it needed was the ability to have keyframes it hasn't got that so basically it's ignoring her and adjusting this man here so there he is nice and slim 100 percent. there he is the other way and he goes bloated okay <laughs> that's just not good that <coughs> excuse me that is a big fail in my opinion okay so we'll cancel that and we'll go out of there again i'll show you another image uh, not that one uh, we'll go to this one now again here another model again super slim there's nothing wrong with that but we would just like to adjust this tummy area just a small amount okay now in photoshop yes we can do it with liquify nice and simple we'll just give it a little push in like i said she's not slim but i just didn't ask her to hold the tummy in enough and there we go this is just a quick fix mind and she's done and it's fixed okay so we'll cancel that we'll put it back to normal we just want this pushing in a little bit again i would have liked the ability with lumina ai to be able to do this for me it can't um all it will do again is i will show you now like i said i'm not bashing the software it's got loads of great features but this one here doesn't work the way it should do now this is bad programming in my opinion or you know whoever was um responsible for this feature 
got it wrong in how it's been implemented in the software. So again, if we could add points, 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 points all the way around, and then just giving slight adjustments to here, that would have been great. But all I can do is go to shape of the body and make a slim. It doesn't fix the problem. It just makes the whole body look silly thin or the other way, bloater, and again, doesn't work. Abdomen doesn't work. All it does is think this area here is the front of the body and put some sort of adjustment there. You might be able to see it working. It looks like this, this part of a body here, just focus there. It just looks like that's talking. Okay, so that doesn't work. On some pictures it will work, but like I'm saying to you, the people who made this software should have thought about this a little bit better and made it more of ability to use a warp tool, you know, that sort of thing, or um, adding key anchor points around the body and then doing it that way. It might have taken a lot more, <laughs> a lot more programming maybe, but then yeah, okay, it would have been miles better. Anyway, that's a quick rant. We'll see you in the next one. And hopefully we'll have some nice things to talk about with Luminate AI. Don't forget, like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.